I've been trying to make this video for three days and the wind has just been blowing. So I'm going to try to get this done. This is a video response to Bill Gowdy, the excellent adventure giveaway. So I have been on an adventure for the last six weeks. I am doing a park host job out here in the beautiful New Mexico mountains. And it is cold right now. I'm going to be cooking some beef stew tonight in the Dutch oven. But before I do that, you know I have my priorities straight. So let's see what we got here. So this is my Dutch oven. I know this is a giveaway for many things. And my Dutch oven is a 10 inch and not a 12 inch and I know the camp made the 12 inch I also know that these are some cheap charcoal briquettes would love to try the camp made I'm not sure if that's part of the giveaway but anyway I have a 10 inch and it's really hard to cook for lots of people with a 10 inch Dutch oven so I'm really wanting a 12 inch so let's get started so I'm going to have some potatoes, some onion, a beef stew packet, some dehydrated corn, some dehydrated green beans, and some carrots. I'm also going to put in some diced uh, tomatoes and some chicken broth. So I'm going to be using a mora knife. And I love this knife, it's really sharp, but the only thing is, why do they make it this way so it rusts? So, I need a new knife. One that doesn't rust. Anyway, that's what I'm using. I clean it and dry it real good. I gotta be careful and not cut up too many vegetables to fit in a 10 inch Dutch oven. Okay, I think the coals are about ready. Got some coconut oil in the Dutch oven. Down there. I use coals like a cook, which is wing it. No recipe needed. <laughs> Spread those out. Now, this is why I want to win the Camp Made Dutch Oven set, is for the handle. I have a Dutch Oven handle, but once you lift it up, what do you do with your lid? I want that Camp Made handle and stand. That is awesome. And of course it's uneven, like always. That would be another good benefit of having that camp made set because the cooking surface surface is even okay let's put the stew meat in some flour with salt and pepper Can't add too much more veggies. Stew meat is brown. So I'm going to start adding all the ingredients and letting it get cooked. Let it cook for an hour or so. I don't have any beef broth, but just need some liquid, so it's chicken broth. Potatoes, onions, and carrots. Oops, lost one. Take one for the team. Had to be a carrot, yay. All right. Can't add too much because my Dutch oven's only a 10 inch. These are dehydrated green beans and dehydrated 
corn. And is it cheating if I use the beef stew packet? I don't think so. That in. Add a little bit more water because I'll get dehydrated, dehydrated veggies in there. Let's stir that up. Yeah. Let that marry for a little while. In truth, Bill, this video is really an entry for Lost on Land again. She needs a Dutch oven. I have a 10 inch and Vicky Bingo has a 12 inch. You know, I don't need to win this. What I would like to win is one of those neck knives or mostly a look at the goodness t-shirt. So anyway, this has been fun. I love your channel. I love all your cooking videos, except that I have to, you know, cook that recipe after you cook it. So I'm always going to the store, always trying it. Dutch oven recipe after this one is stuffed bell pepper. So anyway, this has been fun. I love the giveaway. I hope um, Lola wins the, the Dutch oven set. You're going to hear me say it. Look at the goodness. Oh my goodness, that is cooking up just right. Look at the baby. What? Be sweet. This is an awesome campsite. It has a park host because of the fence, but it also blocks the the mountain view. But all right, I think the stew is ready. So let's see. It has been cooking for about an hour and a half or two hours so let's see what we got oh look at that look at the goodness it's time for some stew yeah mmm what do you think mmm that is so good. Mm, that's awesome. Okay, I have to stop eating to catch a picture of these mountains. The sun is hitting them just like you would not believe. So let's go look at that. I know that the camera will never do this justice, but the sun hitting those mountains is just amazing.